bright red hair, would you give him a chance? Eric Stoltz, yes, I would. Eric Stoltz. Yeah. Because you do, you have to be quite vocal I have a about your then. disdain for redheads. He didn't say I hate redheads. I said the millionaires do not pick the redhead or the curly hair. I didn't say I don't like redheads. I love Deborah Missing. I love Julianne Moore. It's the millionaire mess. Right. I have to fix up the mess. Right. Well, we're going to talk about how you became your own client, which I love. But first, I want to take a look at some of the best advice you've given to others over the past few years. Here's a look back at Patty doing what she does best. I'm a professional and you need to trust me, okay? Otherwise, you're going to point your pecker in the wrong direction. As long as you put work first, yes. you will never, ever be in love. Otherwise, you ever be in love. You get a look yeah. or money. Yeah. You yeah. don't get the ball thing. Very unusual thing. I know. It looks fade and dumb as forever. See, that's why I can't find anyone. To do, I don't care if she's 18 or 80, is never give a guy more than a year. Fixing people up and knowing that you know you're making matches and they're falling in love. Besides getting matches in heaven, I'm doing some kind of service for humanity. He is ask questions. It's like you know what, what are you passionate about? No talking about sex, and that's not going to get you sex. Because when you talk about it, there's no mystery. Girls love the answer. So if you get that, you get this. You know what I mean? They want you to be the aggressive. One. They want you to play on the day, be the tiger. One, two, three. Oh my God. I'm talking about I want to see romance, I want to see flowers, I want to see champagne, I want to see dressed up nice. Oh.